So hi Jiftar, good afternoon. Back again, guys. How are you? Splan, splendid. Oh my God, proper job. Oh, there's loads of ways you can say. Ah, oh, fact that you in Gara, how is the weather? Splan. How warm? How warm and warm? Um, I'm up here on Tigoning Hill. Um, little in my hip flask there. I've got a bit of Daratom, fire water, or hot water, uh, whiskey. Um, just, just one Mrs. Wembley, just one Daratom, my plague. Uh, just one whiskey, please. Um, still learning a little bit. Um, still learning a little bit. Um, I'm gonna, you can say, Robert OV, my name is Robert. Day Genevi, I like Mordatha, surfing. Um, uh, Day Genevi, cows or canoeic, I like speaking Cornish. Or you can say, don't quote me on this, Mia Ilt, Mia Ilta, um, cows or ta tam cows or canoeic, I can speak a bit of Cornish. Mia Il, Mia Il I can. Cows will talk tam bit Cornish. But that's not really what I wanted to uh, say to you today, to everyone, to Pabonan, Pabonan being everyone. Um, on and hag all, one and all. All and greller, all the best. Um, I just wanted to come up and show you this beautiful scenery up here onto Gonning Hill um, in Kerno, in Cornwall, in our duchy. Um, and just say, get out there and learn a bit of Cornish. Cornish is, it's our language, it's our identity, it's our history, it's our future. It's what part of makes us Cornish and not English. And that is a protected minority status under the framework for the Convention of the Protection of National Minorities and the Council of Europe, which is not the EU. That is, um, we, are, we are officially classified as Cornish, not English. And that is our language, Canuic, Cornish is our language. And there's plenty of places out there you can go and learn it, see? Um, we, get, we get lessons for uh, our flege, uh, flegers, flock, flock children. Um, we have that at Cowser roughly every two weeks. That's at Heartlands in the Artist Muse. And at Heartlands, it's free, it's fun, it's informal. Um, come down, bring your kids of all ages. Um, why not? Pragna, Pragna, why not? Get the kids learning it, they enjoy it, teaching them another language, it's getting them out, it gets them socialised, they make friends, they're learning Cornish, they're playing games. Um, and there's plenty of things where you can um, go and learn Cornish. It's great, um, it really is great. I mean, just recently we've done a bilingual tour of Skinner's Brewery uh, uh, by, with Paul Hodge as translator into Kinnewick. Uh We've just done Paul Goon Vineyard um, with... Uh, Love day. I'm watching where I'm going as well. I am, I am concentrating, but I'm looking where I'm going as well. It's a bit of a bumpy, rough track. Um, with love day, uh, Will Coleman organises like the sort of Cornish week, uh, Cornish weekend down at uh, Penzance, Holyhead, Penzance, um, beginning of the year in June. We've got a Cornish. The Speak Cornish week with loads of events and stuff going on where you can just rock up and talk Cornish and learn Cornish, no experience needed. And on Saturday, the Saturday the 30th of June, I'm organising a, um, was it, what are we calling it? Summer summer Tales at the Brewery, down at Dynamite Valley Brewery, down at Pond Snoof. We're going to be um, reading Cornish stories in Cornish and poetry. Just come along, enjoy it. Doesn't matter if you know a little, a lot, or no Cornish. We're going to have people reading poetry and kids stories in Cornish and kids adult stories in Cornish and just have a cool time and like learn a bit of Cornish and all and there's always something going on like I go to uh, the Anchor Glass, the Blue Anchor in Helston and learn uh, uh, there on a, on a to, to learn the mirth, the mirth. Tuesday. Uh, it's free, it's fun, it's informal and it's educational, it's great. And there's places all over, there's Scars, St Austell, Truro, Mullion, uh, wherever you go you can find Cornish lessons. I mean I've got my Cornish pages, We Love Cornwall, three words, capital letters, We Love Cornwall. And that's the main one, um, uh, if you go on that you can find out um, lots of different, oh, per deg, per deg very pretty. You can uh, get led on to lots of different Cornish speaking pages from there. We love Cornwall. Uh, come along, just join up, have a look at it. I'm always using a few words now and again. Um, 
I'm having a few words now and again. Um, dog's having a right, rolled around in the grass and just fell into the girl. Silly girl. Um, key girl, key girl, brown dog. So, um, yeah, all I'm saying is, come on, get out there and learn Cornish. It's great fun. It's 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 educational. It's 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 another string to your bow. It's it's our history. It's it's our future. And getting the kids out there to learn it. I mean, why not? Pragna, Pragna, why not learn it? Ah, oh, stunning up here, isn't it? This is Dagoning Hill, look, see, and you're looking over towards St Agnes over there, see? St Agnes and all. Um, well, up that way a bit. It's so misty today. Well, misty, you know what I mean. And that's like Falmouth, and, and well, yeah, that's probably Falmouth up that way. And what's it? Paul Evans just over there and all that. Um, but there's a difference between dialect and right or your new. Um, right, my lover. Bloody handsome, it is, isn't it? So you've got dialect and then you've got the Cornish language. They're two, two different things, but the Cornish language helps you understand different place names um, and stuff like that, wherever you live. I mean, Truru is probably, that's not probably the best one, actually. Um, apparently it's like Three Waters or something like that, but um, Aberfowl for Falmouth. Um, and then you've got Res Ruth for Red Ruth, uh, Lascaris for Lascard, Lance Stephan for Launce, and they, they're all Cornish words, so you're speaking Cornish words now and again, see? But um, when people say it's a dead language, get a big hole there, look. I don't know what that is in Canuic. I'm always asking people, Pithu in Canuic, Marplegg, what is such and such in Cornish, please? Um, got to watch out for the adders here. We forgot what that yard is, but yeah, when people say it's a dead language, what's the point? It's not a dead language, it's getting bigger and bigger all the time. More and more people are learning it, and it will be dead if you have a negative, um, negative, oh, what's the word? Negative attitude towards it like that, it will become a dead language. So keep it positive, get there and learn it. I mean, okay, not a lot of people learn it, but more and more people are learning. It's fantastic. How can a language be a waste of time? How can a language be pointless or whatever it's not it really is not it's our language um what did someone say it takes more than wearing the golden black or ha uh, do or ha uh, do that's golden black at twickenham for 40 minutes 80 minutes a year to be cornish yeah i know that i do that and i go to all the cornwall games and stuff and i love watching cornwall play rugby uh got the Cornish tattoo, boring. well I'm not going to get into the what makes you Cornish because that's just a whole nother discussion which I might do again sometime up on Tagoning Hill ASC but it's not a dead language, it is. it does have a point, it's vital and get the kids into learning it, get into learning it, it's fun sitting around in the pub talking in Cornish, it's, it's, it's great but anyway, um, that's enough of me rambling on so because there's quite a lot of you, well maybe Maybe more than one person will watch. It's Degenui, which is goodbye to lots of people, or Agasquelles, which is to lots of people. In reply, you can go Degenes, or Vowelles, which is goodbye. Uh, Kemui, take care. Um, I'll point it back again there because you don't want to see my ugly face all the time. Um, uh, get out there and learn it. It's a whole life. Fantastic. Go on, I'm going to watch out for Addis down there. Look. I'm stinging that as I'm in my shorts again. Anyway, that way there's Kemui, Keno Bisficken, one and all, on and haggle. Cheers and gone, y'all. See ya. Get out there, learn it. Love Cornwall.